We kick off with actress Fumi Holder, who has now wrapped up the production of her debut effort, The Grudge. She hosted the cast and crew, as well as celebrity friends, to a VIP screening of the drama. Do enjoy this. Nollywood actress Fumi Hoda, who is cutting her teeth with the debut production The Grudge, hosted a VIP screening of the movie over the weekend. <music> Stars of the movie, including Iretiola Doyle and Richard Mofedamiju and others, joined the producer come actress for the screening in Ikeja, Lagos State. The Grudge focuses on the effect of holding resentment for close associates with focus on the family. Did you even sleep last night? <laughs> Wait, hmm. is this about you and Kemi again? Quite frankly, this is about me. Ah, oh, you guys. I acted on The Grudge and, and produced as well. So that was something I was new and um, it was a bit challenging to, you know, switch from being an actor to being a producer, back to being an actor, back to being a producer, you know, so that was a bit of a challenge. But um, yeah, I enjoyed it. You know how it is very easy to put an actor in a box and say, okay, you're an actor and that's all you can be. I'm so proud of Fumi Holder. It's, it's not easy to produce a movie. Do you understand? So she's taken on this huge endeavor, and I dare say she has taken it on successfully. Um, being an actor, she understood how to handle her actors as a producer. She's done well. I am very proud of her. The Grudge stars fast-rising actress Ijoma Nebo as a young woman who had to endure harsh treatment to make a living. And instead of you two to spend more time bonding, you get a house help. I play the character of Chikodi. She's a young um, mother who is very poor and is trying to better her life. And as such, becomes like a, a house help to you know wealthy people. And a lot of madness goes on in the house. Yeah. When people ask me like, why would you want to do this type of character? And I say, the human experience I feel is a is a global experience. And just getting to understand what other people are going through is 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 is, is, is incredible. Working with industry veterans, including Iretiola Doyle and Richard Mofedamijo, was a career dream come true for her. It's urgent. I need to speak to her. But, Kay, it's not convenient. Well, I mean, well, to some degree, not so much with Antivity because I've known her for a while. Um, and sometimes when, we, when I'm, I see her outside, I'm people like, oh my God, I want you out there. I'm like, you have to remember that this woman is a star. Like, just the fact that you can just be calling Antivity anyhow, you know. But I'd, I'd never met RMD one-on-one. -on -one, so that moment for me was like, oh my God, can we? But they're amazing people. They are incredibly professional. Um, they have no problem whatsoever, you know, helping you out as a young, as a young and upcoming actor. So it was, it was a lovely experience. Richard Mofedamijo is well aware of his influence on young colleagues and in this case, even the director, who is also just cutting his teeth in the movie world. I'm pretty easy to work with, um, I hope. <laughs> um, I love the work, and, and if I notice there is a remarkable age difference, I try to get, uh, make them as comfortable as possible, make sure that um, I'm available, I make myself available to directions. And uh, with him, it, I was more stunned at his approach. Um, he pretty much is a, is a director's, is, a, is an actor's director. He just he gives you the what he's going to be doing with his camera and lets you play. Um, and and I've seen some of the clips and they are really amazing. Uh, in fact, there are times when I would say to him, "Are you sure you you good?" He's like, "Yeah, I got, I got it." Yeah, you know, so um, I'm happy to to be directed by him. The movie chronicles the lives of two lovelorn spouses from separate marriages and a lonely window intersect as they struggle to deal with a grudge that has festered for so long. Didn't you sleep with her, Taya? Tell me, didn't you sleep with her? What did I ever do to you, Kemi? Tell me. I mean, what did I ever do to you, Kemi? Tell me. You know? Tell me so I can apologize to you. I can make amends. I, I can make this work. You know? Can you just tell me? It's it's a it's a major 
thing with marriages, with I mean, I'm in a marriage. It's it's a relationship movie as well. Um, when anything goes wrong and is unaddressed, it just goes downhill from there then on. Um, we all are in one relationship or the other, with our bosses, with our wives, with our kids. And once there is no disclosure, it is very difficult. Uh, like the name suggests, uh, the grudge. Uh, you'll be amazed to find out all the things that are in there. And um, it resonated with me a whole lot because it scares the hell out of you to know that just one little thing, little secret in a marriage can ruin it. And sometimes it is always too late when, you know, communication breaks through and comes in. Um, I just hope that when people watch this film, they will be able to, you know, address their problems, you know, frontally. Where do you think you're going? Where do you think you're going? Akako, make sure your bags are packed tonight because you're leaving my house first thing in the morning. Watching a movie is a subjective experience. Only the individual can tell you what he or she decides to take away. Um, but if there is one moral uh, message in the, in, in the movie, I would say think about holding on to grievances, especially with people that you need to interact with on a continuous basis throughout your life. If I'm going to be your partner, what kind of, whatever kind of relationship, spouse, business, friend, if we're going to be on a journey together, we must rethink our relationships and um, find ways to reconcile very quickly before things, you know, get out of hand. And don't hang on to stuff so much. The Grodge hits the big screen in Nigeria later this year.